our customers are very educated today. They understand um, the technology a whole lot better than 10 years ago. Um, and from the finance standpoint, you know, they get it, they understand it quite well. One thing to consider would be typically through the life of a copier, you want to consider your service pricing. You know, probably 90% of our clients are under some form of a maintenance plan for that piece of hardware. Um, and I don't think we're any different than the rest of our industry. So given consideration to service plans and service pricings is probably as important, if not more important, Absolutely. you know, than the cost of the hardware. Because you look over the lifespan of that device, a customer will probably spend more money in the service and supply piece of that decision than they will the actual piece of hardware. So you want to pay re really good attention to that. I, I think what uh, people tend to forget is how important those devices are to their everyday business. When the multifunctional product goes down, and they go down, we'll, you know, we really admit it. they're mechanical. They're not going to be perfect all the time. But when but they, they got a lot better, yeah. But when they go down, it shuts everything down. If people can't print, you know, if they can't scan no. anymore, I mean, they're, they're, it, it messes up their daily workflow. And if you're not working with a good organization that has a good solid plan of attack, uh, what happens when? Or, you know, when this happens, what? Um, you, you know, it's placing the service call. How long does it take for a tech to get there? You know, is 24 hours acceptable on a, on a machine that's completely down and your business is down? Are you going to be able to be down for 24 hours? So are you uh, saying we should never go out there and tell, them, tell the customer our equipment never breaks down? No, it, no, it breaks down, but you have to be prepared for that. And you have to work with a good company Correct. that you have confidence with that's going to be able to go in there and fix the problem. And if they can't fix the problem, it's, it's communicating with you on what what they can do to help. Sure. How can we keep our business running? So I think that's critical that you work with that the organization. You have confidence in that organization that, that they have your back. 